brought in for Brent Sancho and 19-year-old Scott Robertson. Craig Brewster made two changes to the Inverness Cali Thistle team, which beat St Johnston in the Tenant Scottish Cup. In Stuart McCaffrey and Graham Bain, out Brian Prunty and suspended Ross Tokley. Referee Alan Freeland and Brian Etherson talks us through the key moments. With only one win in the last five games, Dundee had to get back on track as soon as possible. However, Caledonian Thistle were intent on making life difficult. Finding the back of the net in recent times has been a major problem for Jim Duffy. Stephen Robb, who recently rejected a move to Inverness, opened the scoring with a superb solo effort just before the half hour. Stuart McCaffrey and Graham Bain could do very little about the direct approach from Robb, who managed to squeeze the ball between Mark Brown and his near post. The goal provoked an angry reaction from the visitors and player manager Craig Brewster came close with this effort. Excellent control from Brewster and a fine save from Derek Souter. From the corner, Darren Dodds almost snatched the equaliser. The defender has yet to open his account for Inverness. Inverness kept pressing in the hope they would soon find an equaliser. Golabek's deep cross was met by Barry Wilson, but he couldn't direct the header on target. Lee Wilkie could only watch as the ball sailed over him, and Wilson's header left Derek Souter scrambling across his goal. This time Barry Wilson turned provider. His cross was cleared by Lee Wilkie. Then Graham Bain and Liam Keogh combined to carve out this chance for Barry Wilson that eventually came from Lee Wilkie's clearance. Wilson's low drive was well saved by Suter, however, Graham Bain couldn't find the net with the follow-up. Away from home, Caledonian Thistle haven't scored too many goals, which needs to be addressed by the manager. And it was the boss who led by example. And again, Craig Brewster was denied with another fine save from the Dundee goalkeeper. With a goalkeeper in form like Suter, the visitors could do very little apart from producing the shots on target. Dundee's second came three minutes into the second half. Mark Fotheringham opened up the chance for Fabian Caballero. However, his blistering effort was well saved by Mark Brown. But on his debut, Tom McManus was there to get his first for his new club. A new club and a new lease of life for McManus, who's determined to make his mark on Tayside. Cali had to get back into the game as soon as possible, and as Dundee stood back, Russell Duncan, Liam Keogh and Craig Brewster helped set up Stuart Golabek, and he, like his colleagues, found Suter a tough nut to crack. A simple layoff from Brewster, and Golabek seized upon the opportunity. The points were seized for the Dark Blues from the penalty spot, as Stuart McCaffrey was spotted by Alan Freeland handling the ball. And judging by the referee's reaction, nothing would change his mind. If there ever was a case for a stonewall penalty, well, Stuart McCaffrey has just produced it. John Sutton stepped up and converted with ease. Mark Brown guessed the right way, but nothing was stopping this penalty. With the game well beyond Inverness now, pride was the issue for Craig Brewster. And Barry Wilson's snapshot did little to trouble Derek Souter here. Brewster set up Wilson, who couldn't keep his shot down and on target. After several attempts on goal, Craig Brewster eventually found the back of the net in the dying seconds. A decent delivery for Brewster made life easy to get the consolation goal. As the clock ticked away for Caledonian Thistle, they looked for a second. 
Graham Bain's shot was handled easily by Derek Suter and Dundee were delighted to get back to winning ways. It was a good day for us. Uh, we mentioned to the players before the game that this, you know, this could be a, a vital match for us. It's, it wasn't uh, one of bust, but it was certainly a very, very important match. In the first 20 minutes, I thought we looked a bit nervous. Um, but once the game settled down and, and we scored the goal from Stephen Robb, um, we started to grow a little bit. Although, uh, in saying that, uh, and when this Caledonian Thistle, I thought were excellent today. I thought it was a, a very open match and, and at times too open.